Hey geeks, so let's talk about a change Netflix has made that made me absolutely hate watching things on Netflix. And so I, like many, many millions of other people, paid for Netflix. And for many years, I actually had their premium plan. And before, it was just called something else. But bottom line, I've spent thousands of dollars with Netflix. And then once they instituted their no password sharing, I decided I didn't want to pay for Netflix anymore. However, my cell phone provider offers a plan where if you pay for your cell phone, depending upon which cell phone plan that you have, you actually get some streaming services like Netflix or Apple Plus or Hulu or Paramount for free. Okay, so that's what I did. I decided to get the standard plan and things were good. I was okay with getting the standard plan and still having access to Netflix without paying for it. However, my cell phone provider just made a recent change where now they bumped me down from standard to standard with ads. And let me tell you, the experience is absolutely horrible. Now, all of us are used to having ads, you know, when we're watching stuff online. Okay, so here's an ad right here before I even watch the movie and it is non-skippable. Um, and so in this case, uh, I'm not able to skip this ad. And already, I don't want to watch it, okay? But if I try it again, um, let me see if it shows how many ad breaks. Okay, here's another ad. So I can't even like, yeah, I can't even like <laughs> watch this yet. And so in some cases, the ads are 30 seconds. Some cases are over a minute. And depending upon the movie or show that you are watching, uh, they could have multiple ad breaks. So in this case, let me kind of show you how many ad breaks. There's one, two, three four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12 ad breaks on this one movie. So you can imagine as you're watching a movie or show, there's ads most of the times before you watch it, there's 12 ad breaks in between. That is an absolutely horrifying experience and it makes me not even want to watch anything on Netflix. And the thing is, this would be okay if you are on a platform that is free, like you're watching something on YouTube or you're watching some of these free streaming platforms. And my favorite is Tubi. Tubi, I actually spend more time watching stuff in here because they have a lot of movies and shows, most of which don't even exist on Netflix. And even though there's ads here, well, it's a free platform. And to be honest with you, the ad breaks here or nowhere near as annoying as they are on Netflix. And as uh, you've probably seen, ads are pretty much on every single streaming service now, whether it's Netflix, uh, Apple Plus, Disney Plus, Hulu, Paramount Plus, you know, HBO Max, any one of them, they have a ads plan. And that's the worst thing about this. You're paying something like $7 a month, and you will be paying more in the future, and you're getting the worst possible experience with ads. And so that is something that I don't think is going to go well in the long term. And I'm pretty sure like there's going to be many people like myself, if they're not able to get this for free, we're going to stop paying for it because the experience is absolutely horrible, especially you are paying for it. Whereas if it's something like Tubi and it's free, I am okay with that because obviously they're giving it to free, so they got to pay for it somehow. So that is my uh, huge rant on Netflix today. Um, if it wasn't for free, I would not use this service. And to be honest with you, most of their content nowadays, their original programming, most of it just isn't great. You know, there's only a few shows or movies that I actually do want to watch, and it's only available on Netflix. But for everything else, I'm either watching it on Tubi <laughs> or I'm just watching stuff on YouTube. So uh, those are my thoughts on Netflix with ads. Absolutely hate it. And uh, hopefully <laughs> Netflix loses money from doing this. Uh, they probably won't, but I'd hope they do. And more people stop paying for this stuff. And hopefully uh, these streaming services will realize that they're losing customers and maybe they'll go back to something that makes more sense and uh, get rid of these ads. So if you actually had any thoughts on this, be sure to leave in the comments area below. And I'll see you on another episode. Hey geeks, if you are a brand new creator and you simply want something easy to get you started, 
Well, I got something for you with my Creator Starter Kit. This is a super simple step-by-step -step guide that's gonna take you from having no channel to developing your very first YouTube channel along with ideas, thumbnail designs, and other creator tips including marketing. And the best part is, all of this is free. Simply head over to the link below, check out my page, and get started creating.